Well, I have a lot of favorite characters. I have Max and Maximum Ride and Alex. And, but the thing about Bennett, I think, is Bennett is the character who's evolving in a very interesting and um, engaging way. It's a really good character. He's got 10 kids. He's been left with them. He's a single father. And he's also involved in these terrible, terrible murder cases uh, in, in, in New York. So it's a tough road to hoe. And, and he just keeps changing and growing, which I find you know, really interesting as a writer. I, I think this is, TikTok has one of the most fascinating plots that I've, I've, that I've done in that the famous old Son of Sam murders start to be repeated, and then the Mad Bomber murders are repeated, and uh, the Werewolf of Wisteria murders. These are all famous historical New York murder cases. And they're all happening at the same time. And uh, Michael Bennett has to s try to come in and try to solve or, you know, these, these various murder cases. Uh, yeah, I, I want all my, my books to come to the big screen. We just have to get Hollywood to cooperate. Uh, we have a, a script on Michael Bennett. I think it's a really good script. Uh, Gerard Butler is, is interested. And from what we understand, there a lot of... Uh, male stars will be interested in the part because the notion of his family, Bennett's family, these 10 kids, and, and combining that with, uh, with suspense is kind of uh, irresistible for, uh, for uh, stars of a certain age, meaning, you know, 40, and 40 to 50. Yeah, I did live in New York for, for, for quite a long time, and... Um, does that filter into the book series? You know, I guess occasionally. I love what most people love about the city. There's always something to do here. Um, uh, it's some of the best restaurants in the world. There's always a movie to see. There's always a play to see. Uh, you know, the, uh, TikTok isn't really about eat the rich and famous uh, as much as it is just this very involving murder case because all of these old historical New York uh, crimes are coming back, Son of Sam and Werewolf of Wisteria and the Mad Bomber. So it's not really about rich people, but it's about sort of rich, middle, and poor people in New York all being terrified because uh, um, the city's never seen anything like this before.